What's up, early gang? Let's hope everything works, huh? Let's hope everything works today. Who could say? In general, when it comes to streaming on Twitch, who knows? <laughs> who knows if it'll work, you know? We're going to find out. Sounds like it's working. That doesn't mean anything. Let's try something. I hear it. Perfect. We're working, baby. All right. Dope. Dope, dope, dope. I'm trying to decide if I want any uh, tea today. I can't decide. I can't decide. What I really want is Russian tea, but I don't have it. So I'm kind of just out of luck there, you know? Why well, should I never plug that back in? Oopsie. 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 Oh, boy. Well, hopefully we're streaming. Hopefully everything is functioning. Kind of forgot to do that. You have that experience? You ever that experience where you just kind of forget what you're doing? What kind of tea? I've got a lot of options. I've got a lot of options over there. I've got oolong tea. I've got lemon tea. Um, wait, let me see what else I have over here. Here's my variety. Here's my variety pack that I'm working with right here. So we've got some... Uh, Lemon Zinger, some afternoon Darjeeling tea. Uh, it tastes a little bit like black tea. Oh, it is black tea. Look at that. Huh. Yeah, it tastes a lot like black tea. Um, I have lemon and ginger, and I have some oolong. But I don't know. Been partial to the Tazo Passion. Tazo Passion with um, apple juice, steamed apple juice and honey. 10 out of 10. If you've never had it, I recommend it. They used to do it at the Starbucks. The Starbucks. But then Starbucks started doing Tiavana. Not a fan. Not a fan of Tiavana. But Tazo Passion, uh, steamed apple juice and honey. We used to call it sick tea. It's kind of like a, um, a throat coat. If you're sick, it makes you feel real good. It was also the secret weapon as a, as a singer. Back in college. So if you have a solo for a church one day, know that that's what you need to rock with. Yeah, what the heck? I'll do some tea. I'll do some tea. Let me go brew some water. Go brew some water. Why not? Why wouldn't I? What have I got to lose, huh? Let's see. I usually include honey. Do you just steam apple juice instead of hot water or a combination? Uh, just just apple juice. I normally boil it in a pot to steam it. If you want to, you could you could put the lid on and get actually some like actual apple steam going, but really just boiling it's enough. The good news is about it, I don't I don't know if you really burn. What's up, Weesh? Pog you live. How we doing? We're playing some more Arceus today. Um, but the way I think I'm going to do it is I'm not going to go through the story at all. I'll only do side quests and shiny hunting, which I've already gotten two shinies so far. I'm looking forward to doing some more shiny hunting. I think it's going to be fun. I think we're going to have a good time. We lit. I have to keep that in mind. It's very good. Very good. Excellent. Have you played much of the game over the weekend? I'd say that. No. I'd say I've, I'd say I've played some. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how many hours I've actually logged, um, but it's it's got to be in the it's got to be in the the two digits at this point. Hey, yeah, what? How about this hoodie, huh? How about this hoodie? What do you guys think of that hoodie right there? How do you feel about this? Oh, what's on the back? You ask. Well, since you asked, since you asked, what's on the back? There we go. What's on the back? What's up? What's up? What's up with that? Buy that. 
March. I'm only here for about an hour because I have my UM Doctrine class. Technically, I should be reading some more Wesley right now. We should always be reading more Wesley. At any given time, we should be probably reading Wesley. That's what we're that's what we're here for, right? Now the question does still remain: Which T am I going to do? Reading and living Wesley are the same thing. Hardcore agree. I think maybe some lemon zinger. Totally jelly of the hoodie. It's there. It's there. It's on the site. Yeah, I think some I think some lemon zinger sounds like a delight today. I'm a big fan of lemon zinger. Folks, I gotta tell ya. I gotta tell ya. Even more so than watching uh Arce uh, watching Arceus. Even more than playing Arceus. I'm hooked on this talentless Nana show. Oh my gosh. I finally decided what it was. I've had trouble figuring out like what it relates to, what it's similar to. And um, it is it is My Hero Academia meets Death Note meets Danganronpa. I mean, if you could custom brew a, a smoothie of anime for me, for this guy right here, I can't imagine anything better. So, so far, I, I have a couple episodes left. We'll see how it ends, but I'm, I'm about two-thirds of the way through, and uh, so far it's a 10 out of 10. Yeah, an anime smoothie. You guys are familiar with the anime smoothie, aren't we all? We all talk about anime smoothies on a pretty regular occurrence. Everybody knows the anime smoothie. By the way, I was watching uh, YouTube the other day, and the latest completionist video is on Chicory. You guys remember Chicory? That was a lot of fun. All right, let's pull this game up, huh? Let's pull this game up. Let's get into some Arceus. Some Arceus. This is also our first three-hour stream, so we'll be streaming until about 2.55-ish, because I've got a meeting right after this. Let me go ahead and turn off Spoofy. Goodbye, Spoofy. So I'm going to try my best. I'm going to try my best not to spoil anything. I really hope I don't spoil things, you guys. I'm going to try really hard not to. <laughs> I don't know what can be spoiled except for, like, new people, right? I mean, I guess that's something you could spoil. But, uh, yeah, I'll just show you guys around. I've got red hair now for whatever reason. I want to show you my favorite thing about this game, okay? This is my favorite thing about this game, and I'm going to show it to you right now. Are you prepared? This is the most exciting thing. You, I didn't realize this. You can cast out um, your Pokemans and they can just chill. So I can just send out all of my Pokemans and they can just hang out. Look at this. This is all I ever wanted. Dude, this is all I ever wanted, man. <laughs> Find me, find me a better thing that they could have included in this game. You can't, because this is this is all I've ever wanted from Pokemon. Is it too loud? By the way, I changed I changed my settings because you know how it wasn't working last Friday. What's up, Pineapple Pope? Let me know if it's too loud. I mean this. So this is my favorite, my new favorite thing to do. Better thing: control the Pokemon in battle. Oh, like like uh, FPS style. It's pretty good. The, the battle the battle mechanic in this game is real good. I'm not going to lie. Oh, what's going on? Oh, no. So here's the thing that I've learned about this game, okay? So this is the main mission. These are the side missions. And this is what we're going to work our way through today. So on, on these kind of streams, we're going to shiny hunt. We're going to do these side missions. We're going to do all that sort of stuff. Cool? That way, that way you guys aren't um, getting too many things spoiled. This is the hardest mission I've ever experienced in my entire life. So this is the one we're going to do on stream. Cool? Because it can't be done. It cannot be done. I'm on my third location now. I'm going to try not to spoil too much. Um, I might. I might. We'll see. Let's see. Intro video. My professor legit says, my name is blank, but you can call me Dr. J because my name is very long with multiple capital letters. He included text in the video and says, and a hyphen. What just happened? Why did I not go? Oh, because I'm still there. Ha. Huh. Uh, for some reason, I'm finding this highly hilarious and thought you might appreciate. Hilarious. 
Yeah, Perspectus, I guess that would be like the mystery dungeon. Okay, we gotta go to morning time. That's where Buizels are. So this this mission in particular wants you to find a uh, a weasel, a buizel, a buizel that is two foot eight, and um, I am having no luck finding a buizel that is two foot eight. We're gonna try. We're gonna try. Uh, the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna drop our Pokemons here because we don't need them. So I'm going to drop off, uh, let's see, I'll drop them up past your three. That way we don't have to, let's see, who do I need? Who needs some leveling here? Kadabra? No, Kadabra's the highest level. Rhyhorn needs some leveling. This is my current squad. Yeah, true. I just want something that feels more like the anime. Something like Unite, but not Unite. Man, I love Unite. I'd be all sorts down to get back into it. Trevenant just entered into the, the fray. Uh, I've also, <laughs> one of my favorite things to do now is to just, just throw Pokeballs. Yep, get your clips in. Today's the last day, friends. So there are a couple things you want to do in this game. I probably should have had more mods. Uh, I have a rideable mount, by the way, now. That's kind of a spoiler, I guess. No, we got him last time, didn't we? I don't remember. He jumps. It's very fun. Today's the last day. All they got. He's just so much faster. He's such a faster boy. So you can throw these apricorns. Knocks them out. And you throw a ball. You get to see them. Bam. Yeah! Uh, that's one way to catch them. No, he's new. Well, now you guys know. <laughs> I also have the Basket Legion, and I may do some adventuring in that today. They were in the trailers. They were in the trailers. I don't have any more. I don't need more of the thingies. That's no good. That's no good! Don't need more thingies! Um, I will say, I had a TPK in this game the other day, and that got me. That really got me. I cannot believe I got a TPK in Pokemon. That proved to me beyond a shadow of a doubt that this game is a great game. Because if I'm losing at Pokemon? In the main story? Wild. I couldn't even tell you the last time I've lost in Pokemon, except for, um, was it battling that Rapidash? No. Oh, no. No, I, I did. Did I die then? I guess I did. Um, I meant, like, in a Pokemon battle. Just, that's just very rare. That's not so, oh, whoopsie. Didn't even notice I was fighting this guy. It's just not something that happens very often, you know? All right, we got some Lemon Zinger here. Cheers. Cheers, friends. So, these Buizel actually do have heights, uh, and it's actually very irritating. And uh, some of them are, most of them are not big enough. By the way, this little pro tip right there, this little pro tip, you can clear that gap once you get, once you get chip away. If I find an alpha, um, then I'll actually be able to, to, to do something. But if I don't find an alpha, we'll just have to keep catching them like this. I've probably done this run, I don't know, 16 times. I just can't. I can't find one that's two foot eight. I, I'm, I'm, I've seen people do it, so I know it's possible. But it feels truthfully impossible. How's everybody's Monday going? How'd your weekends treat you? Whoops. <laughs> just yelled. Why? <laughs> Snowy. Man, I'm jealous. Weekend was gone in a flash. Now that's relatable right there. That's exactly how I feel. Nine foot or nine inches? <laughs> I always forget which one is which. Gotta be nine inches. There's no way you got nine feet. What is this, Alaska? <laughs> All right. It's Jersey. Jersey, nine inches. Every time I see the um, inches or feet, my mind always goes to feet for some reason. Oh, wait. Where am I going here, please? Nine feet would ruin the state. 
<laughs> Night feet would ruin most places, I feel like. I gotta get me some more of those uh, spoiled apricorns. Got to. That's a lot of damage. This is the one, though. This is the one. This is the one. We're going to be getting a two foot eight weasel right here, right now. Or we're going to find an alpha and then it'll just be over. If I could find a stinking alpha. Lurk. All good, Pineapple Pope. Thanks for the lurk, my friend. Hope you're well, by the way. Discord's been hopping today, huh? I hopped off for lunch, and whenever I got back, it was like slammed. Slammed with messages. I love it. Love to see it. Love to see it being used well. I need to write down on my to-do list to do my Alice is Away thing. Gangsta grass really blew up. Yeah, for sure. I still haven't had a chance to even listen. But it's all over the place. All right, let's see how we did, huh? First things first, we gotta check our team. <laughs> oh, wait, there we go. All right. Two foot one, two foot three, two foot five, two foot six, two foot. Oh, that excited me with Rhyhorn there. All right, nope. The answer is no. But these could be the ones. Two foot two, two foot one. It's a big negative. <laughs> and I don't know, if anybody knows if there's a way to uh, multi-release, please let me know. I would love to know if there's a way to multi-release, because I've been releasing one at a time, and it takes so, so long. It really takes an incredibly long time. I, I'm just convinced this can't be the best way. There's got to be a way. There's a way to multi-select, but then I can't release. So if anybody knows, it's really just a Google away, and I haven't done it, and I don't know why. The UI and UX of the game is actually really fantastic, so it's it's a big bummer. It's a big bummer that this is somewhere where they drop the ball. How many Pokeballs do I have? 29. See, what I really need is some apricorns. Scare off weak Pokemon. Oh, interesting. Very fun. Oh, I need some more tumble stones. Okay, so I need to do, go on a little tumble, tumble stone spree too, huh? Can do. What's up, out of sense? We're just hunting for weasels. We're hunting for a hashtag tall boy. Once you unlock the ability to access the pastures, you can freely swap in and out your party by talking to the main. Yes, yes. You can also release Pokemon when talking to them since you will have access. Yeah, I know I can release them, but can I multi-release? Can I release more than one at a time? Thanks for the lurk, trombone Dalek. Dalek. Okay, similar to PC boxes. All you need to do is release the Pokemon who captures access to pastures. Select the Pokemon you want to release. Scroll down to release. Confirm the choice. Because the game is pushing you to capture so many Pokemon. Where? All I have to do is fill up four pastures? I didn't know that. Okay. Cool. Then I won't release another thing until I get the feature. Time to fill it up, baby! Okay, I can definitely fill up four pastures. That shouldn't take that long. Oh, wait, hang on. I need these. <laughs> Tumble stones. If I could just if I would just hide, then it wouldn't be a problem. Boop boop. Don't No, you know that's me. Why you know that's me? Uh the, so I watch this guy, Austin John plays on, on um YouTube. He's my he's my informant for all things Pokemon. And he was straight up just eyeballing how tall they were, and I was like, I don't know. What kind of wild eyes you have, but absolutely could not ever hope to do that. Okay, my 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 poor um, astigmatism doesn't allow me to tell height differences in the pixel. Let 
Okay. Oh, uh, whatever. Let's just go for it. He was asleep and everything. I probably could have done it. Need to level up, apparently. Dude, the more the more that I discover people on oh whoopsie. The more I discover people on YouTube, the more I realize I am not MLG Pro. It's wild what people can do. People are so good at video games. I've never thought I was great at video games, but I, I also have never thought I was awful at video games until I see other people play the games that I love. <gasps> an alpha! Ah, yes! I don't have any Pokemon on me that are going to be any good at catching an alpha. Okay, 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 okay. Hang on. We got we to gotta improvise. We got to improvise. Oh, come on. Are you serious? I don't have a single... Mm, this is going to be tough. Okay. Okay, this is going to be really tough. Okay, okay, okay. I really need him to not see me. I really need him to not see me. So how am I going to sneak around him? I don't have any smoke, because of course I didn't think to bring that with me. He will not run away from me, which is good. I just got to get close enough. Yes! Come on! Come on! Please! Please! Son! That's what I'm talking about! Yes, sir! Let's find out how big... Oh, watch it not be. Watch it not be big enough, dude. So I, I don't know. It might not actually... Four foot two! Four foot two! We did it! Yes! Oh, it feels so good. Finally. First try. Ha <laughs> ha! All right, let's go show off our, our buizel. Let's go show off the buizel to this guy. Oh, feels good. <laughs> Doggone it! I don't even think you guys understand how long I've been trying to do that. Oh, stressed. Stressed, man. All right, we know. What I'd like to do now, I would like to return to the village, please. I gotta go show off this buizel. Now I gotta figure out how to do the Cherubi one. I don't think you can actually do the Cherubi one until you unlock another uh, rideable mount. Big complaint about this game is that you can't have your mounts out in town. It takes forever to get across this place. I have completed a lot of requests so far, though. But we got plenty more to go. Plenty more to go. But I might be able to now that I have the swimming thing. Maybe I'll maybe I'll be able to find a Cherubi. Can you use mounts in battle or just to ride around? You can escape from battle. It's a good way to get away from them. Ha 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 ha! Ha! Yes! Look at that weasel. You sure you want to get this Pokemon? Sure, he's going to be huge, dude. He's going to be so tall. Ha 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 ha! Look how tall he is! Oh, he's so much taller than the rest of the Buizel, dude. Four foot two. <laughs> I wonder how big he would have been uh, as a, as a float soul. Well, I'll be. I didn't think they could get this much bigger. Like a parent and his child. What if there's room for me in that little family? Okay, dude. <laughs> Whoa. What a precious little thing. Uh, more reassuring about how large it is, don't you think? I guess. All right. Hilarious, dude. <laughs> yes! So I married my weasel today. Or I married my weasel today on Jerry Springer. Look at that giant weasel, dude! <laughs> Lily tiny weasel! Hang on, I'll throw out more. I'll throw out some of mine so it's just like an even better comparison. That's all these little tiny weasel. <laughs> Just mom and the kids. <laughs> oh, it's so fun. Love this game, dude. Love this game. Cannot even tell you the joy it brings. I also got to release these weasel. I don't need all these weasel. I have enough. Thank you. So another thing that you have to do in this game, and I, and I want to explain to you guys what the Pokedex is. Another thing you have to do in this game is you can do perfect Pokedex entries. So I'll show you what that means. So these are the Pokedex entries, right? These are all, these are all, oh, that's true. Keep them for the pastures. Good call, Bleach. Thank you. Um, 
these are all of the research tasks that you can do. If you get all of them done, you get a perfect Pokedex entry. When you get a perfect Pokedex entry, your likelihood of finding a shiny doubles. So the only perfect, I have, I have a couple perfects now, but the first perfect I got was Bidoof. And so you see how it says perfect down there at the bottom now. That's because I completed all of the tasks. Now, the first thing you have to do to even say that you've caught a Pokemon, even if you've caught a Pokemon, they do not, they do not show the little Pokeball symbol next to them until you have 10 on the research level. Every check mark is worth one point unless it's the double arrows, at which point they're worth two points. I think that's how it works now. I don't know that, but that's how I think it's working. So I, I have a shiny Buizel. No, it's perfect. I was about to say, I do not have a shiny Buizel. Do I have a shiny Buizel? I don't have a shiny Buizel. I, I don't have a shiny Buizel. I'm like 99% sure I don't have a shiny Buizel. Unless I just accidentally caught one somewhere in the, the thing. All right, do I have some that I'd like to leave here with me? I would. Oh, I don't have a shiny Buizel, dude. I for sure do not have a shiny Buizel. Stressing me out. I may have ac accidentally done that. So these are my my two shinies are here. I have a shiny Ponyta. And I have a shiny Bidoof. And I'd like to do some more shiny hunting today. I might have accidentally released it. Let's look at them. Look at my friends! Look at my friends! Got a bounce. All good, Bleesh. Thanks for hopping around. All right. There we go. Those are my shinies. And I want to I want to get some more today. It's my goal. My goal is to get more shinies. My goal is to complete mini quests. So I think I'm going to go explore the first region now that I have Basque Legion. But you know what? I probably should have gotten more Pokemons out. Because I really want to try and find a Cheruby. Because that's pretty much the only thing I have left to do in this first area. I think. Yeah. Cheruby. I, I have to complete the Cherium um, Pokedex entry. Which shouldn't be that hard. But I gotta get to it first. I also need to do some stuff in the Crimson Mirelands. Let's see. A Roselia, I could do that. How do I evolve Roselia in this game? I don't know anything about that. I could learn more about that one. Find the charm. I don't like doing these find. The find quests are awful. I had to look it up. I had to look it up. Full transparency, I had to cheat. I couldn't. I couldn't handle anymore. Oh, I could do that. I can totally do that. Go to my storage. I think I'm sure I have three pot pods. I'm pretty sure at least, yeah. Perfection. Hey, who's down here? Is he inside? Oh, yeah, I gotta go down to the basement. Yeah, we're just gonna complete a bunch of these quests. Get me further along in my in my request category. And do some shiny hunting. Go around. Have fun. Gotta explore the water area, so that'll be cool. But yeah. I know I saw Autosense pop in. How you doing, Autosense? Have you bought a Switch yet? What can I do? What can I do to, to, to convince you? Because this game is so much fun. I am running errands. So this guy doesn't ever want to help you, but once you give him what he wants, he helps you. That's all it takes. He just wants to cook. All right, now we'll have more stuff. More stuff for me to buy. Muy bueno. I like buying things, please. Man, ye of little faith thought I wasn't going to catch that weasel. Alright. Yeah! New items. Let's see what you added. Okay, so now I can buy the scatterbanks. Okay, I got more stuff that I can buy. Neat. Neato. I wish he would lower his prices. That's what I really wanted to do. I might have more recipes to buy over here, too. Let's find out. I need to know. I do. Ooh. Superb. One fine remedy and one vigil. Don't mind if I do. I always buy all the recipes. The first thing I do. <gasps> yes! Finally! 
Oh, we about to make some big money now. We got star pieces. Heck yes, dude. Let's go make us some star pieces. Oh, wait. I'll be right here. So star pieces are one of the best things you can make for money. And the way you make them is you pick up red shards, or red, red, blue, and green shards. I'll show you guys where to do that. And then uh, you keep all the stardust, and you can make them. And they're worth a lot of money. So we can make at least six. Oh, no, because it takes it takes six. I see, I see, I see, I see. It takes three. I thought it took three. Yes, it does. Okay, perfect. Yeah, yeah, it takes three. All right, dope. Now I can sell these. And make some money. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Look at that. 10,000. Already made back the money. Already made back the money. You'll love to see it. I'll have to show you guys a space time distortion as soon as it pops up because that's super cool. Definitely another excellent, excellent part of the game. All right, let's see what other quests we got going on. Okay, Cherim, the Wisps, the Three Leaf thing, Roselia. I don't know what this is yet, but I'm not. I don't plan on going to that area. Oh, I might be able to do that one. Let's see, we'll find out. Three Hardy Grains, two Hopa Berries, one Raspberry. Octillery. I definitely have. Oh, if I, if I have these Hopa berries, I don't know anything about those. Bosley. And Almus. Okay. Let's see. Let's go ahead and do this. What was I doing? <laughs> what was I doing? I don't remember what one was doing. That's embarrassing. My brain! Oh, yeah. I was going to go talk to the person about the Krogunk. Sure. Let's talk to her about her Krogunk first and foremost. I've learned that you can you can dash in this game for about eight seconds, and that's all you got. After those eight seconds, you are just out of luck. But when you're on your friend's back, this is Nurse Joy. I have to catch a Krogunk. I might have one. I probably have a Krogunk. I can just give you. Would you like my Krogunk? There you are. Have him! I didn't want him anyway. And I'll be catching a million of them. Bing. Nice! So it's kind of fun. As we're playing through the game, we're like learning that um, that we can work alongside Pokemon. That's like the whole point of the game. It's like these people are all afraid of Pokemon. And as I continue to do these requests and these missions, they're like learning that Pokemon are okay. And then somewhere along the line, things go horribly, horribly wrong. What was I about to do? Why was I running this way? Oh yeah, the farm. You can also have them farm stuff for you. I haven't quite figured out a timer yet of how long this takes. We could find out on stream. Social commentary. Great timing. So you can have these guys farm stuff for you. That way you get a bulk amount of items at once. I would like you to plant some crops for me. I'd like berries. And the more Pokemon that you get to help them, the more fields they make. So they, they currently have three. They need one more field. But the request is not ready yet. Bam. Um, let's see. Let's set a timer. Okay, Google, set a timer for 30 minutes. Sorry for everybody that has a Google Assistant. We'll check our farms in 30 minutes, and we'll see if it's ready. We'll see if that's how long it takes. This guy also always has some really cool stuff. Always buy his stuff. Oh, nope. He doesn't have any cool stuff right now. I don't know how often that restocks either. I think it's playtime. I don't think it's actual time. Let's see if I have any of these Hopa Berries. No. Oh, ah, I have exactly one. Okay, cool. 
So that's that's enough for some things. So let's see what needs a Hopa Berry. I think I had one that needed three Hopa Berries. Oopsie. Do not feel like going through all those. That takes two Hopa Berries. This takes one. One Hopa Berry, one Springy Mushroom, and one Suit Root. I have Suit Root. Let's find some Suit Root. That it. Move one. All right, where do I take in this? In here? She got it. In my day, we had to use an egg timer. No way, man. I got I got robots that I can talk to. So you buy rare candies from these peeps. Oh, I was talking to the little girl. <laughs> I was like, why are you not talking to me? I'm ready to learn. What am I learning from you? Learn from the master. I'd love to learn. Okay, when eaten, this curious snack temporarily swaps the Pokemon's offense with his defense. Neato. That's pretty cool. Why do you know Pokemon puns? I thought y'all didn't like Pokemon. Why do you know Pokemon puns? Mm -hmm. Curious and curious. All right. Gamba time. Oh, we do. Okay, Gamba time. Let's see. That one is... How do we do that one? I got to go here. Got to pull up Twitch real quick. How well do you know Nate? Got to draw out an extra card here. Oh, please don't come through the speakers. Got to draw out an extra card. It's coming through the speakers. Time for big money. I can't believe I can't believe Buish is uh missing big money. Okay. <laughs> Let's find out. Start a prediction. Start prediction. Can Nerd Pastor Nate uh do the Dougie. Yes. No. 30 seconds on the clock. Starting prediction. Can he? Dougie! Oh my goodness. 30 seconds may not have been enough time. Oh, that's going quick. That's trucking by. One second. Wow, man. That was the fastest 30 seconds of my life, dude. All right, can he, Dougie? Uh, we have 83% yes, 17% no. The answer to the question is, I cannot, Dougie. I do not know what the Dougie is. I know what the Dougie is, but I don't know what the Dougie is. Now, if it had said um, floss, the answer would still be no but I could at least tell you what it's supposed to look like. I cannot even muster up the imagination to tell you what the Dougie looks like. But I know the, need you, you, you to teach me how to Dougie. <laughs> That's all I got. That's all I know. Oh, nice, got some full heals. Swap snacks, got a bunch of spurts. All right, what else do I need? I think I was supposed to go talk to other people. I do Gamba so I don't play real poker. Hey, that's fine. Whatever it takes. Whatever it takes to, to help make it through the day. Don't want that. Don't want to do that. <laughs> okay, so I might be looking for some Hopa Berries. Octillery, I'm a choke. Let's go ahead and do this. Speak to this guy. Excuse me, while I speak to this guy. By the way, every now and again, this um, MC makes a sound that you cannot convince me they didn't just reuse Link's sounds from Breath of the Wild. <laughs> yeah. All right. Listen, I've been gathering combi honey for work. 
Okay, do you need the honey or do you need the combi? Or do you need me to complete a uh, Pokedex? Oh, three different areas. From Grueling Grove. Oh, no, I don't even know where that is. I don't know the areas. We got Lonk on the table. You brought this upon yourself. I can't help myself. Dad! As if I could help. Okay, he's got to hang on. He's going to turn the... He's going to turn the... He had to turn the thing. He's got one little hand on it here. Dad! I play the game! Let's see. In my club, I will splash the pot whenever I want. Name that gambling movie. I don't know. I don't know many quotes, if I'm being totally honest. All right. We're going to go explore. We're going to go explore with Basque Legion. Yeah! I love him so much, dude. Yeah, I got no clue. Returns your film major card. <laughs> yeah, I'm not a films major. I did take uh, French cinema. All right, let me move back in my mods. I thought about buying a link cable and going ahead and evolving into Alakazam. I may do that by the end of the stream today. So in this game, I don't know if you can evolve them by trading, but you can definitely evolve them with a link cable. It's kind of like a stone. I'd also really like to find a time distortion for you guys so that you could see it. None currently on the docket. Ooh. I can swim there now with my Basque Legion. Oh, I have so many more areas to explore. I feel like I want to explore so bad. Let's see. Rounders with Matt Damon, Edward Norton, and John Malkovich. I do love John Malkovich. And I do love Edward Norton. And I do love Matt Damon. So this it sounds like a pretty good start. Uh, who should get some points? Who should get some points? Probably my Rhyhorn buddy here. Let's go ahead and give them all to him. See if we can't get ourselves a ride on. Nope. Level 28, though. That's pretty good. Uh, weird thing that they do in this game is you don't evolve uh, naturally. You have to actually select and evolve when they get ready. Isn't that weird? I thought that was super weird. You know what? Maybe I should take Dartrix out because I don't want you guys to um, have Chiboy spoiled. Mm, whatever. It's fine. It'll be fine. We'll figure it all out. All that I really care about is that I want you guys to see the um, space-time distortion at some point during stream today. And I gotta get a lot of apricorns and all that good stuff. Keep an ear to the ground for a sound. The shinies make a sound. This guy's super stinking cool. Weird ear. Another thing that I've learned is that you don't actually have to hang around. You can just, um, you can send your Pokemon out and then you can just walk away. <laughs> You can just you can just walk away at any time. You don't ever have to hang out. You just keep moving. You just keep moving. You got you have no problem. Can you ride any Pokemon or just that one? You can ride a couple, but you can't ride any. There is a, there is a list. So I can ride I can ride Weirdier. I've also unlocked um, Ursaluna. Ursaluna is a um, item detector. So Ursaluna will see, you can see the little, like, radar or whatever. It gets bigger as I get closer to whatever I'm looking for. Just gotta find... Real close. Real close! There it is. And you dig for treasure. Star piece! Nice! Five grand, dude. Uh, but weirder is much quicker. So if your goal is to get around... Round, round, get around, I get around, I get, I get around, round, round, I get around. If that's your goal, then that's how you do it. It all just depends on what you want to do. Um, I don't know about Arcanine. Got no clue. Uh, maybe. I've only unlocked three of the rideables. Or, yeah, yeah. My other one is Basque Legion, which I'll show you guys in just a second after I get done doing some item collecting. By the way, this is what I could do for the entire time in the game. Just straight up item collecting is some of the most fun stuff. I, I never, I have yet to get bored just doing this. Just hanging around, running around, sending out a quick mon to do some collecting. Oh, an Eevee. Nice. Whoops. I accidentally used my heavy ball. Didn't mean to use a heavy ball. Hang on. Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Did it get away? <sighs> Got away. Let's see. Are the battles random or do you have to initiate? 
Both? Yes? The answer is yes. Technically, you have to initiate every battle. Who is that? A shiny Shinx? Uh, excuse me. Uh, excuse me. I don't have any of my thingies. I don't have any thingies! Oh, no! Where'd he go? No! I don't want to fight that Shinx! I don't want to fight that Shinx! I want the other one! I want the other one! Okay. Okay, I'll just catch you both. Dude, whatever. I'll just catch you both. I just want the shiny, please. No! 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 Okay, that's fine. Just don't do it again. Just don't do it again. All right, I'm gonna send out a great ball. I gotta have that shiny Shinx! I didn't even- I didn't even hear it, dude! Uh, yeah. Third shiny, dude! I just saw him, I was like, what Pokemon is that? Oh, <laughs> yes! Third shiny, baby! You'll love to see it. Okay. The battles are random, but you also have to kind of initiate them, and you can get away at any time. So I'll show you what I mean. So let's just, let's find somebody that'll fight. There are two types of Mons so far that I've found out in the wild. There are some that run away from you, hence Starly, right? So if they see you, they're gonna run away, and they'll get away before you can catch them. If you try to initiate battle with them, they'll run away. Same with Wormpole. However, I still can't believe I missed that at Eevee. Eevee would have been nice to get. Let's find something that I can actually fight. Oh, wait, there's another, another apricorn tree? Goodness gracious. All just centralized, huh? Okay. Find something I can fight. Bidoof will fight me. Ooh, or Ponytail will definitely fight me. Okay, so then if I see them and they notice me and they get angry... Ooh, no, he's just sweet. Ponytail's gonna get angry. Maybe? Y'all are all so sweet, dude. Y'all are all adorable. Okay, I send out a Pokemon, I fight it. So it'll start a fight sequence. It's just real naturally occurring. I can still run around. And if at any point I want to leave, I just run. You sure you want to run away? Yes. And then it just picks me up right where I am. And I'm right there. And then I just run away. No big deal. No problem. It's so nice. I've, I have yet to be bothered by a fight in this game. Every fight is just when I want to take the fight. I initiate the fights. I'm the one who knocks. I don't think I've been to that area because I didn't have Basque Legion. So I'll show you guys what Basque Legion does. It sound, it's just like it sounds. You get in the water. Normally you drown. Bada bing. Woohoo! That's it. That makes it look like way better than my previous experience. I'm, I'm, I'm not going to lie to you, dude. This is, a, this is a better Pokemon game. I'm really enjoying this game. Like more than just about any other game. So here's the thing. You can run away from battle, but you see how I got the little red eye up there? That means I've been spotted. Whoopsie. Didn't mean to waste a great ball. It means I've been spotted, and they will start sending random attacks at me. And uh, they will actually hit me. And if I get hit too many times, then I black out and lose a bunch of items. Hey, a combi. Hey, I need one of you. What you doing, buddy? Oh, don't run away. Don't run away, friend. I caught him unawares. Uh, let's see. I guess I probably could have jumped to this with Weird Ear earlier. That's fine. It's a real fun game, dude. It's a real fun game. Is this Grueling Grove? Am I completing that mission? This is Grueling Grove! Hey! I didn't even mean to. I didn't even mean to complete missions. I'm just in here completing missions without even meaning to do it, dude. You don't even think about it, though. You don't even think about it, though. Uh, but for real, I recommend this game highly. Uh, I don't even... <gasps> An Alpha Heracross? Uh, I think yes. Yes, I would like that Alpha Heracross. 100% I'm going to catch that Alpha uh, Yes, yes. Let's see if I can catch it without it seeing me. That would be nice. Not likely, but nice. Kind of looks like he sees me already. Come on, walk away. Does he see me? Why is it saying no? Why is it saying no? Is he too high of a level? He might be too high of a level. I might not be able to attain level 45 yet. Oh, what a bummer. Well, now I know where he is. So all the alpha Pokemon stay where they are. That's another fun fact. If you wanted to know more fun facts. 
There's a lot of fun to have in this game, that's all I'll say. There's a whole lot of fun to have. There's so much to do. I'm so overwhelmed with things to do. That's one of the complaints that I heard about this game, was people were like, there's not enough to do in this game. They're crazy. I literally cannot imagine having more to do. But they were like, it's not a creative enough game. What are you talking about? Each area is just the same. Every game, each area is just the same. You're just playing a game. There are things to collect. There are mons to complete. There are dexes to build. What more do you want? Nate, did your tea finish brewing or did you forget about it? It's right here. Right here. I decided on the lemon zinger. It's my choice for today. I feel pretty good about it. Uh, so there's another rideable mon that I'm going to get at some point. That's going to be right here. That I'm going to be able to break through this wall. But I don't know when I get that. If Elden Ring wasn't coming out this month, I'd probably pick it up. I think that's totally understandable. Here's my advice. This game will never go on sale, unfortunately. So that's a bummer. But just get it once you can. It's totally going to be worth it. I'm curious to see if they come up with some DLC. If they do DLC, this game will be just doggone perfect. Uh, but it's real fun. Is it perfect? No. Is some of the graphical fidelity weird? Sure. But the people that are like, this game is, is just the same as, um, what is it called? Gales of Darkness. Well, no, it's not. Because in Gales of Darkness, you couldn't just throw a Pokeball out in the random. Why is everything orange? It's it's like um evening. It's evening all of a sudden. Uh, the fall damage in this game is real, by the way. So that is a big bummer. If you aren't anticipating the fall damage, just be prepared because it is real. It is dramatic. Ooh, an alpha sh alpha alpha shinx. That'd be kind of fun. Why not? Those little janky eyes. Alright, where are we going? Super effective. I don't really want to kill him, but he's he's not he's not that far. I might not. Oh! <laughs> and I oh I sure did. I didn't mean to kill him. I didn't mean to do it, officer. I'm going to be streaming FFX. Feels like forever since FX14. Stole my heart. Yeah, have you been enjoying it? I think maybe 30 bats and Zando would be thrilled if I'd pick up that game, but I just I just haven't had the drive yet. Maybe. I appreciated your why not joke, by the way. I appreciated it. What should I do? I'm trying to decide what to do with my time now. Let's see. Because I caught that I caught that grueling grove combi, and that's kind of nice. I'd kind of like to go down here and, and figure out what else is down here. I want to know what's on this island. I'm real curious. Now that I have Basque Legion. But I prefer it were daytime. Let's see. What is that? It's a time sink. A fun one, but still. Yeah. Time sink games are fun. That's definitely what I'm experiencing with this one. This game is... If I didn't have the time right now, I don't think I'd be having as much fun with this game, but I do have the time to have fun with this one. And that's always a delight. Ooh, how are my items doing? Do I have plenty of space? Ooh. Oof. Nope. Nope. Let's go exchange some items. Dude, if I could remember even one time what button does what, I'd be so much better at this game. All right, let's see. I would like some, yes, I would like some of these. I would like some. I wanted to stream blind but could not play, right? Yeah, that's how I feel about this one. I was like, yeah, this is, this, it's not gonna happen. It's just not gonna happen. There is, there is nothing you guys could do to get me to not play this game. I had to play it. 
I do have one of those. I guess I'll use the last one. Maybe I'll find more. <gasps> Ooh, candy. We love candy. All right. Let's go ahead and use it. On Chipboy. Nice. All right. Now we can go. Now we can go. Let's get in the water. Go for a swim. And that was the day Nerf Pastor Nate decided to become a seven days a week streamer to, uh, yeah, constantly be streaming this game. I would, dude. I would if I could. Man, can you imagine? I wish I knew. I, somebody needs to teach me the shiny sound. I know that it exists, but I don't know what it is. Acres. Ooh, an apom. An alpha apom? That's pretty cool. I wouldn't mind an alpha apom. I could handle that. If I can take it down, is the question. They're pretty tough, man. These double battles is real tough. I think I'm going to create a new tune to stream for the story and my own private tune. I would also like to know that. I need to take this one down and fast! Oh, come on. Are you kidding me? Bogus. Bogus. There's no reason I shouldn't take him down at one. Going back to Lurk to find the floor of my room before class. You got this. You got it. Oh, man. I'm not happy about that. I'm not happy about what's going on right now. I'm not happy about how this fight is going. That A-Palm should have gone down, dude. Tune equals character. I think that was World of Warcraft lingo. We always called our characters tunes. Very interesting. Tunes. Downloads. Characters. Oh, man. This A-Palm is really giving me a run, run for my money here. Machoke, can you do it? Clearly an, a big old noob. I feel the same way, my friend. If I go agile, I'll be able to attack sooner. Hitting the dork niche. Yeah, that's one thing that I was hesitant to put in our, like, nerds, geeks, and gamers. What is going on, dude? Ah! I'm telling you, these battles are tough. These battles are so tough. They never used to be, man. Just all one-hit KOs. Every last one of them. All right, Kadabra. Can you do it, buddy? Can you pull it off, friend? Can you actually hit on your own turn? Or will it not let you? Half health. Of course it has a dark attack. Why wouldn't it have a dark attack? Just makes sense. Just makes sense for have a dark attack, dude. Do you think you can survive a hit or do I need to use a revive? Let's just try it, dude. Oh, no. Let's just try it. I doubt it'll work. But there's always a chance. Hey! Alpha Apom caught, dude. Now I gotta go and heal. This is not what I anticipated. Get work, just cathartic. Hey, not worked. I won. I'm telling you though, this game, like if you if you've played Pokemon before and we're like, this game is for babies. If you if you've ever thought that thought out loud, play this one. It's not that it's like the most challenging game in the world. It's not Dark Souls. But it'll actually give you a nice little like Run for your money. It stresses you out a little bit. That's nice. Really nice. Nice for a pocket man game. 
Yeah, that's the thing. Is that's why I've been so hesitant of like I don't want to. I don't want to. I don't want to pretend like this is like a crazy challenging game. I don't want to act like I'm like, oh, this is the hardest game I've ever played. But it's just, it is, it is a challenge as compared to like every other Pokemon game. Where you're just wiping the floor until you get to competitive. And then once you get to competitive, you can't win. I feel like this is actually like preparing me for, for some com competition. Some Abra's down there, huh? Get back into water. You can jump twice as Bascule Agent for whatever reason. It's kind of fun. Okay, so this is where the Apom was. Is there anything else on this island? Nope. Uh, I've never been over there, right? Oh, no, yes, I have. Yes. Yes, I have. I've never been here. Yes. Let's just go there. I've never caught anything in the water either. Is that a quillfish? Oh, he's mad. How do I fight him? Ooh, ooh, he's got he's he's gross. Level fifty-five. Get me out of here. Level fifty-five. What do I look like to you? Somebody that can take on level 55 mines? You'd be wrong. I cannot. Let's see. You're among dorks, so don't sweat it. We did draft video games for Fantasy Critic the other day. I may or may not have put in a bid for my first game. But I don't know if you guys can see that. I don't know how it works yet. Hey, Shellos! I'm supposed to catch you cool cats and kittens. I don't remember if you're the ones I've already caught, though. No clue. No clue if you're the ones I've already caught or not. But I'm supposed to catch you for a quest. Starly. I do not need you. I am not in need of a Starly. I'm telling you, that is one of the most charming part of this game. It's just to just, you just toss a Pokemon, you're like, hey, go do that. And then you just run away. And they go back to their ball when you need them. It's so ding a dang pleasant. So there's just nothing over here, huh? Oh, there's nothing over here. Oh, there's something over here. Okay. That's who's over here. This is Monkey Island. This is Monkey Monkey Island. All right, let's see. Let's, um... <laughs> I'm not going to be of an appropriate level. I'm just going to go ahead and mark. This is a spot where an alpha is. No. I should have marked where that Heracross was, too. Diagniabat! Like, tell me that wasn't just Link's... <laughs> Had to have been. Okay, so this island was pretty uneventful. Wonder what? Wonder what's the heartwood? That's where the. Uh, that's where the. Uh, that's where the. Uh, that's where the. That's it. That's that's that's. That's where the cherim are. Well, then that is where we are going. We are going to where the cherim. Oh, wisp. Wisps are another thing. You have to get 107 of them, which is so many. Truly, so many. For those of you that are Pokemon goers. You probably know what that is. Ooh, a low punny. Uh-uh. Nope, nope, nope. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Not interested. Ow! Not interested. Not interested. Thank you. Please don't hurt me again. Please don't hurt me. Please, none of you hurt me. I don't want anybody to hurt me, please. Okay. So is this the heartwood? Am I in the heart? Oh, we need to go check on the things. Don't let me forget to go check the farm, you guys. Should I go check the farm or should I continue adventuring? The farm's fine. It'd be so disappointing to get there and then have to come right back. Like especially, like, what if they're not there, you know? Alright, I gotta find a chair armor or a cherubi. 
Is this the heartwood? Not yet. Okay, the heartwood's up here. Okay, I still got time. I got plenty of time. That mountain distracted me. Oh no. Whoopsie. <gasps> An alpha G dude! What's up, G dude? Uh oh, is that my last Pokemon? No. He's the only one that's weak? Why? Why? Well, this is gonna be tough. It's gonna be tough to get him down to an appropriate level. But we shall try. I would love an Alpha G, dude. Let's go for a Agile Psycho Gun. Good call! Good job, Kadabra. Not as good. Great start. Really, really great start. Not a good finish. Not your best result, but a great start. Let's just throw a great ball. Let's just see. He's not that high of a level. Yay! Alpha G, dude! Noise. All right, first things first, I gotta... Okay, I'm out shooting today in D.C., but just wanted to stop in and say, hey, I really enjoyed the Nerdy Sermon this week. All right! Yeah, Mushika Tensei. It's popping off, man. We hit just the right niche. We hit just the right niche. It's crazy. I can't believe how many people we've reached. But yes, goodbye! Thanks for joining us. Appreciate it as always, my friend. I think we're up to like 300 views on that one video. Overnight. Should be back to RVA in an hour, so if you're still on, I'll lurk while I drive. I'll be on till 3. I'll be on until 3. So you should be there. Should be able to make it work. If you are available. What's a Tensei? Well, apparently I pronounced it incorrectly. <laughs> I have no idea how to pronounce it. And, um, I've already gotten, I've gotten, uh, so here's the thing, okay? I get, I get, uh, um, mocked for that pretty often. And I don't know what to do to help. So, with, um, Demon Slayer, the reason I mispronounced, uh, the main character's name is because I was reading the manga. And when you're reading a manga, you know what you don't get to hear? Characters' names. And so once I watched the show, I was able to actually know how to pronounce his name. But before I watched that, I called him Tanjiro. And everybody was like, Tanjiro, what's wrong with you? And I was like, I don't know how to pronounce it is what's wrong with me. I, I don't know how to pronounce it. Of course I don't. How would I know how to pronounce it? With this show, the title of the show is never pronounced. It's never presented to me. How would I ever possibly know how to pronounce the name of the show if it is never given? Saw a quote the other day, never make fun of someone who mispronounced the words they never heard. That means they read it to learn it. Exactly. So it looks to me, whenever I look at the word, it looks like Mushiko Tensei. Tensei as in sensei. That's my perspective. Is it Tensei? I don't know. I don't know. I got no clue. Maybe. Sure. Where is Cherubi? I need a shaking tree. Anybody see any shaking trees? Need a shaky shake. Shaky shake tree. Anyone will do. Getting a little deep past the heartwood here. Shaky shake. Shaky shaky. Nope, no shaky shake. Shaky shaky. Anywhere? Ah, saw it. Shaky, shaky. Come on, Sharon. Dad, Combi. 
rants. All right. Just knock it out. Mama says knock you out. It's the same way with One Piece. A lot of those characters I did not pronounce correctly. Whatever that means. Whatever it even means to pronounce things correctly. They're all we all make it up anyway. Words aren't real. Words don't exist. Shaky shaky. Shaky shaky. Anywhere? What was that? Wormple. Anything shaking in the woods? Is anything shaking in the woods? Is anything shaking in the woods? There's nothing shaking in the woods. Okay, cool. Ah, so much for that. Well, let's go back to camp. Still no, still no time dilations or anything. Let's go back to camp. Not quite sure what that sound was. That was a new one for me. Really? A seat of mastery? Huh. Never seen that either. Look at me. Look at me getting all these new things. I got a lot of Pokemon to sort out, too. And we can show that guy a combi. I would like to report. Sure. Dude, I can't believe I got a shiny and two alphas. That's a heck of a run right there. Made four grand. We don't need that. Ooh, very close to my four star rank, too. So fun. Life's so fun. But yes, that's a great perspective, stained glass. Great perspective. Let's check our farm. Hey! What you got for me? Stealth spray? I will take it. Always buy this guy's stuff. Always buy his stuff. Because, man, it's a good deal. Every time. Every single time. Uh, nope. Farm is not ready yet. Okay. So farm is not ready in like 45 minutes. Oh, a wisp. Nice. Got him. That's another thing we could do. We could look for the remaining wisps in this area. I can't fit through there. I can clearly fit through there. You're losing your mind, old man. Let's return this guy's combi. That's the first thing I want to do. really need more tea before too long. I did. I did buy you a combi from Grueling Grove. It's so cold in my house that I've had butter out all day and it is still hard. That is really cold. What's happening? What's happening right now? What are we doing? Why are your eyes so dark? What happened to you? Two more places. A Palm Hill. Is that in the first area? I certainly can. Is that where I just was, where I caught that Alpha A Palm? That sounds pretty likely, doesn't it? That sounds like a thing that Pokemans would do. That sounds like Pokemans. That guy was just vibing with honey tasting. I mean, I can dig it. Oh, I guess I'll go over to the pasture and organize my mods. You misspelled Ohio. <laughs> oh no. Let's put, put him in my shiny spot. Nope. Um, and I have an alpha box as well. Move these bad boys.
is the alpha box. Who else was who was the other alpha that I got? That eight bomb. Let's see if I caught the other shellos. Nope. I need the green shellos still. Goodbye. Do I have a female combi yet either? Nope. I don't recall seeing a combi on that eight bomb mile. Is that my only combi left? Yeah. I also have quite a few Eevees that I could evolve if we wanted to. Oh, I guess I haven't ever released anything from the pastures before. Neat. All right. Where is Apom Hill? <laughs> yep. Or Apom Island. What was it called? Yeah, it's got to be in another location. What's up with the Paris here? Oh, a mass outbreak. I've never been a part of one of those. Oh, I don't know what that means. Can I go there right now? I don't even know what that means. I want to go find out. What is a, what is a, what is an outbreak? No, I don't want to stay out. I want to go there. <laughs> don't tell me to stay out. I want to go there right now. PSA, release your Pokemon? What does that mean? I don't know. Like, I guess because you want the grit from releasing them? All right, where was that? Hang on. Where was the Paris thing? What is this mass outbreak? I've never seen one of these before. Oh, it's just a bunch of Paris. It's just a ton of them. There's a ghastly. So what is this? What do I do? Do I just destroy them? I mean, I will. Do you want me to just kill all these Paris? I will. I'll do it. I'll kill every last Paris. They'll all be gone. I will exterminate. Exterminate. Just got dark. I don't know what it means. Why is it called an outbreak? It sounds like zombies, dude. Zambos. If you are telling me to eliminate the Zambos, I will do it. I mean, it's just levels for me, yeah? What's the point? What am I doing? Why am I doing this? And maybe it's like a, a shiny farm because there's so many more of them or something? Uh oh, I got caught up in my own my own flames there. Didn't mean to. Outbreaks are literally just lots of Pokemon and shiny farms. That's it? What a weird thing to include. I'll take a shiny Paris. Like it just happens randomly with random Pokemon. I've seen some people that just leave their maps up on their game and just walk away and just keep, like periodically check back until they get that. Whoa, whoa! Boosted shiny rate? Nah, that's cool. Well, that's very cool. How much? How much of a boosting? Is it like a double? If that's the case, that's very cool. How long do they last? Uh, the uh, the time distortions. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Hold up! I want to heal. I want to heal Monferno. <laughs> Let's see. Without any modifiers, each Pokemon in a mass outbreak have about a one in one sixty chance of being a shiny. What? And I I don't know if I have any modifiers for Paris, but I might. Wild, if true, dude. The only problem with these mass outbreaks is that then you're, like, potentially fighting one on three, and that's really stacked. But I'm also just grinding for Monferno here. Pretty solid. Right. Risk definitely outweighs the reward here. 30 hours in this game, and it's one of the best Pokemon games ever. If you ask me, yes, I agree! 
Yali the, the, the Guru. I almost called you Yali the Gulu. Ooh, an alpha. I'll take an alpha. I agree. I, this is quickly becoming one of my favorite Pokemon games. I'm not going to lie. Um, let's go for... Agile doesn't change anything, does it? Does Mach Punch? No. What about Mach Punch with Agile? Nothing? Okay, well... Oh, this stresses me out a little bit, but this will be fine. We'll be all right. What? One hit KO to level 35? At least it wasn't a shiny. Is that it? Is it done? Does it end with an alpha? Is that all she wrote? Or are you continuing? The music definitely ended. I don't know how many hours in I am. I doubt I'm 30, but I'm probably not far. Did it end? I, I have a feeling it ended. Because the music stopped? I don't know. The reported Pokemon seem to be gone. Cool! Well, for my first one, that was super neat. I didn't really know what it meant, so I was a little bit confused in the first place, but super down with it. Uh, sure, whatever. You want to fight, Ghastly? Let's fight. Let me direct you to Checkpoint Church, Top 10s of 2020, if you want to know what good means here. Hey, I defend that list. I... I stan my own list, dude. I made the list, so clearly I like it. I look forward to just continuing to go back through the years and disappointing stained glass with every step of the way. I changed my Twitter bio today to um, his own biggest fan. Because that's how I feel sometimes. <laughs> with my hot takes, I feel like I am my own biggest fan. You gotta love yourself, man. You gotta love yourself. Love others how you love yourself implies that you have to love yourself too. All right. What am I doing here now? Do I, I, re I didn't really want to come here in the first place, but I'm here now. But I really want to go, is, is this where Apom Island is or whatever? It's a big negative. What's next? Caught a lot of Parises. Oh, no, I didn't. I killed a lot of Parises. <laughs> I don't have to like anyone. I didn't say like. I didn't say like. You don't have to like a single soul. Do good, do no harm. That, has, that says nothing about liking. And I guess, no, you don't have to. Hang on. I still need to figure out what the APOM thing is. That's the problem with this game. The only problem that I found so far is that there's so much to do that I get, um, what's it called? Is it called input paralysis? Does that sound familiar? I think it's called input paralysis. And that's one of the things that this game is causing in me. Yeah, I think I, uh, I mean, I think Nate pretty much hates me and he hasn't given me out yet. I do not hate. No hate. Do no harm yet he chooses violence in his top 10 list. No violence. No violence. If I chose, if I did top 10 worst games lists, that would be violence. I would be doing harm. But just by saying the games that I like, no harm. No harm, no foul. But I will talk about games that I think are trash on stream. I will mock a game to its face. All right. I feel like if I'm running into a lull of what to do next, maybe I ought to just start completing some Pokedex pages. Getting some perfects. I could do some Starly. I need to catch 25. I need to catch 20 without being spotted. I need to defeat 15. I need to evolve three. I don't know if I have three to evolve. But I will if I start catching them. Need to be daytime. Does anybody know if it's called input paralysis? I swear that's what it's called. There's so many things to do that I don't do any of them. Or I just get stunned in place. I'm that dude in the church that just talks to be contrary. Hey, that's fine. Gotta have a contrarian. Choice paralysis is what I was thinking of. But I definitely feel like I've heard input paralysis too. 
Decision paralysis. That's, yeah, that's another issue. I don't think that's the, the thing going on here. Did they see me? Did they see me? Do not see me. Do not see me, little friend. Want to catch you. Excuse me. Armchair psychologist. That's all right. Oh, come on. Hey! One for two. One for two is fine with me. One for two is good for you. That's what I always say. Can't even tell you the number of times I said that. That exact phrase. Bam! Nice! Nice shot! That's the sound that that makes me think of. So I wouldn't mind a shiny Starly. That feels like a chonky Starly. Maybe I can tell the pixel difference. For the record, Pastor Nate is my dog, in case anyone's taking my, my trolling seriously. All good. All good fun. There he goes. He ran away. Yeah, all good fun. So I think it's kind of cruel. I don't know if you noticed how it's like whenever I hit them in the back, they're like, oh, like that's uh, that's that's a thing. There's actually like if you hit them in the back, it hurts them worse and gives you a, a higher chance of catching them, which I think is a little weird. I think that's a little demented. But, you know, I guess to each their own. But I think that's a little weird. I think that's just just a little weird, Pokemon. Why'd you have to make it look so painful? Is the thing. You didn't have to make it look so painful. I really want to hear what the shiny sound sounds like, because that Shinx just totally snuck up on me. I need to find some Starlies. Starly! Where are you? There's that giant Rapidash. Can't even catch you yet. Ooh, an Eevee. Did he see me? Ooh. Oh, he saw me. There's a chance. There's a chance. Slim chance. Got him! Starly! Dude, where are all my Starly at, man? I need to find the Starly. I don't care a thing about Wormpole. I have no opinions on Wormpole. Hydrate! I'm almost out of tea, so I really don't have much more to hydrate with. I need to make more. He must tea. I haven't seen a shiny Buizel either. Come on, man. I wonder where the Starly are. Just running in circles at this point. Sing song voice makes it sound like Nate is in a white unmarked van with candy roaming out and calling out for the children. Oh no! Oh no! I hate that comparison. I don't like that one bit. Oh, a Starly. Starly. Come out to play. Come here, little buddy. <laughs> Oh, come on. That's some nonsense. On that note, I'm heading off for glass. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, no. What a note to end on. Well, thanks for hanging out with us today. Trombone. Ooh, uh-oh. Chug. Chug, chug. Yeah! Oh, he's still there. I mean, like, yes, he did technically spot me, but he didn't spot me whenever I caught him the second time. Gonna catch him for the front. He's gonna chill in the water. Yeah! Complete that, Dex! So many medicinal leaks around right now. Going to one other. Ooh. Going to one other area and coming back really got it done. For real, got it done. But for real talk, I could play this game for hours and hours. Yay! Twofer. You love to see a twofer. Ooh, ah! him in the face. Nice! Alright, how many more? How many more are we in need of? Two more? What? Two more, at least in that category. Whoa, whoa, whoa! You should not be able to see me. I am sneaky. This is Sly Cooper rules. Okay, you're not allowed to see me if I'm in the sneaky sneak mode. There's three of them! Do it. Oh. Una mas. Una mas of both. Oh, no, I've done it there. Okay, una mas. One more starling. It doesn't even matter if it sees me. We just got to find one. We just got to find a starly somewhere, anywhere. Starly. Come out to play. Here he was. Oh, he wants to fight. Oh, never mind. I had the thing up, didn't I? Uh, 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 go. Okay. Also, from the Final Fantasy I'm currently in, I have Shin Megami Tensei and Immortals Phoenix Rising awaiting my attention. Ooh, both good calls. I'm assuming you mean Shin Megami Tensei 5? That's the one I'm assuming you're speaking of. All right. Whatever, dude. Why did you have to see me? I don't want to play right now, Geodude. You're later. Right now I'm completing Starly. Exclusively Starly. Bam. I've heard really good things. That's another game that I've also heard is real challenging. The rumor mill. Okay, I gotta trade into and get a Starly out, right? Bam, bam, bam. Yeah. Oh, I also gotta defeat 15. Okay, and then evolve three. You got it. I want to see. I want to see my Pokemon. Uh, okay. Let's trade it out for a Starly. Let's find it for our highest level. Start us on a incline at least. I'm gonna put you somewhere else so I don't forget about you. Don't want to forget about ya. Okay. I've already evolved one, right? So I just gotta evolve one more after that. Four, two, three, four, four, three, four, four, four. Dope. Super cool. Not a problem. I gotta fill four pastures, dude. That's so many pastures. Alright. 
Let's go for it, huh? Let's defeat some Starly. Now I gotta find more of them. That's gonna take forever. Maybe I ought to, maybe I ought to rezone. That might help me. Might ought to start out by rezoning. Smash your pasture. <laughs> you love it! Let's see. I have never played the others, but I completed Persona 5 The Royal. So good, dude. Such a good game. Very different, but very similar. What's going to be tricky is actually defeating these Starlies instead of them running away. Because they're going to want to run away. No, why did he get to go twice? Let's just knock it out. That's <laughs> such overkill. <laughs> Be Catherine back in the day, too. I dig Atlas. Atlas is a fantastic company. Fantastic company. It's going to be tough getting all 15, but we got it. We got this. Don't run. Don't run. Cool. Love it. Overkill! Ba bam! Nailed it! Now, what level does Starly evolve at? That's gonna be our next question. For a second, I thought I was just fighting grass. Why does it get to go twice every time? Is it because Rhyhorn's so slow? Don't run! <laughs> no! No! I don't like the white van allegory we're, we're working with here. I don't like it. I don't like it one bit. So it gets five and seven. So they definitely get considerably more experience, but I could I could get I could do way better if I start going in here. Excuse me. I'm going to go to the higher levels. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. I guess I could go ahead and start beating Geodudes, too. Why not? Why not? Why not just annihilate a Geodude? Oh, didn't mean to do that. I'm going to need to get out of the way here. Thank you. Did some annihilation Geodudes. So for those of you that don't know, you have strong style and agile style in this game. Strong style takes up two power points. So that's a big deal. That's a big deal. Do Geodudes evolve into Geo Bros? Graveler, but close. I see where I see where your head's at, and I think you should have been on the translation team. I think we missed we missed an opportunity whenever they didn't put you on the translation team. Come here. Bing, bing. I gotta say, I'm already digging the longer time slot because we still have another hour and a half of stream. That's pretty cool. Quakermon Geo friends, oh no. Don't run away. Ah, Starly! Diagniabet. Diagniabet, Starly, we didn't need you running away. Oh, come on. Why did he not die? Did he have sturdy? Bam. Urgh. I didn't even know they had alternate moves in this game. Oh, Geo, dude. Yep. We'll see, man. We will see, we will see, we will see. But so far, this is my goatee. Odds are it'll end up going to an indie. Indie games almost always end up taking my goatee. But so far, it's for sure this one. No, don't run away. Don't run away. Don't run away, please. Don't you do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. No! 
How am I supposed to destroy you if you keep running away? Don't. No! All right, we're gonna have to put a faster Pokemon out there. Sorry. I know you wanted XP, uh, or uh, ride on, but not happening. Just sorry to say. I wish it could. I wish I could do that for you, but I just can't. Bam! Come on, Monferno should totally be first. How am I not first? How am I not first? I should be so much faster than Starly. All right, it's very possible that I can take it unawares. Maybe that's how I can take these down. Okay, I caught it unawares. So that means I go first. Thank you. This Dagnab game. Pokemon or Wesleyan for Beanie, Justicar, and Sanctiflyer. I love it. I love that. I love all that. All about it. Make it happen, Cap'n. Whatever I can do, I will make Wesley Mon happen. John Mon. Mon Wesley. <laughs> I like Mon Wesley! Mon Wesley made me laugh. Oh, this is what a wacky game, dude. Mon Wesley. Yeah, yeah, I'm all about it. That's the one for sure. The good news is, is that I'm probably completing the Geodude decks, too. Sorry, forgot to lurk before AFK. You're all good. You're all good. We always appreciate a lurk. What did I miss other than Wesley and Pokemons? I'm not sure. I'm reading back to the chat. We had we had some talk about um my sing-song voice reminding people of um, Creeper Vans. That was great. We really appreciated that. Super cool of everybody, really. Super cool. Always appreciate some nice, nice kind references of the sort. Nice, that's a lot of Tumblestone. <gasps> Just gotta sneak up on it. We gotta be really, really quiet. Oh no, wait, that's not a Starly. Not even worth my time. You're not even worth my time if you're not a Stally. If you're not a Stally, you're not even worth my time. Get out of my face. You ain't even a Stally. What does yours think you are? Oh, speaking of yous. So I took a, um, I think it was from New York Times. Mm -hmm. Maybe Washington Post, not sure. But there was an article posted yesterday on one of my friend's feeds that was talking about um, your dialect. And I took the quiz and I was like, oh, what's he going to say? Like, you're you're from, you know, Georgia or something. I thought it was going to say I was more Southern than I am. I'll be doggone if it didn't say Winston-Salem, where I was born, man. I was like, What? It was, it was like Winston-Salem, Lexington, Greensboro, North Carolina. I was like, what are you even talking about? How do you know? Those are the three areas where I grew up. Insane. Little did you know the survey writer is just stalking you. Right? That's what I thought. But there were, there were a lot of the words in there that were very, very particular. Like, one of them was, what do you call the little, little river-dwelling crabs that resemble uh, lobsters? The small lobsters that are in rivers, what do you call them? That's pretty specific, I feel like. They have a lot of different names in a lot of different... You say crawfish? Some people say crayfish. I say... Crawdads. That's very Yadkinville, very Yadkin County, 
Yadkin River. They're known as Crawdads. Heard both. Oh, I certainly had heard all of them. I've heard crawfish. I've heard crawdads. I've heard crayfish. I've heard all of them once. But I call them crawdads. There were a lot of questions that I got that I was like, which one do I use the most often? Like, I say you guys a lot, but I also say y'all. What's a deli meat sandwich on a long roll? That was one of the questions. Yes. Uh, I say sub. I say a sub. But there were a... What is happening right now? I don't understand what's going on. Some people say hero. Some people say hoagie. I say sub. Some people call it a po' boy. That's a lot of the beach people. So there you go. I'm sure that's how they would get you. If that's the only play, if y'all are the only ones that call them hoagies, then I'd about guarantee that's where the source, that's where it would find you. Some people say hero. <laughs> I do wonder where hero comes from. I could be a hero, baby. Those are the same people that eat blood sausage. I know some blood sausage eating people. Fun fact, the pearl of the sandwich is heroes, not heroes, and that's a sin. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty rough. I did not know that. All right, how are we doing my Starlies? Are they evolved yet? I'm almost done. I didn't need to know that, so now I'm burdening everyone with that curse knowledge. It is. Oh, look, I was feeling the rain. Did you see that? Isn't that nice? I wonder if my Pokemon do different things in the rain. Do you like the rain, Monferno? I feel like you would not be a fan of the rain, but you don't seem to be too bothered. Not too bothered. Okay. All right, let's go. Um, let's go back and make it daytime again so that I respawn those uh, Starly. Take them down again. What level are I at now? Level 12. Level 12. I wonder what level they evolve. Can't be too far. Can't be too far from here. Ooh, yes. More of these, please. I just want to move them. All right. It's fine. Uh, daytime. Need to make it daytime. Morning. It is always raining in this game. I'm telling you. It feels like this game just rains and rains and rains and rains. It's not raining now, of course. Why would it rain whenever I say it rains all the time? It never rains in California. And girl, don't they want you? It storms. Man, it storms. Need more tea! Whenever I went to um, San Diego at the airport, and this airport, uh, San Diego airport, has the little robot, the little courtesy robot that you can download the app and buy things from around the airport and it'll bring them to you. And I really thought about it. I think if I'd been in the airport longer, mm, probably would have had to experiment with it because it was super neat. But that's what I was just thinking of right this second of like, man, wouldn't that be cool? If right now I could just want some tea and just be like, robot! Robot, fetch me some tea, please! Although I suppose you do have to have somebody that makes the tea, puts it in the robot, and then sends it. So the, the, the need for someone to actually brew the tea is still pretty integral. But I'm still, I'm still kind of done for there. How many Starly have I taken? <gasps> Why is that Starly faster than my Monferno? How many Starly are left? Come on. How many could possibly be left? Six. Six more Starly. That is so many more Starly! The good news is I have nothing but time. Ba -ba 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 -ba! 
Ba -ba -da -ba -ba. But yes, a little, a little, a little robot would be nice right now to be able to um, get me a fresh pot of tea. I'd like a fresh cup of tea, please, robot. Excuse me. Kapow. I'm definitely achieving how many Geodude I'm supposed to be. That's for sure. Although, watch that not be a requirement for Geodude. You don't have to be any of them. Or it's like an anti-requirement. You have to not take down any Geodudes. If you've taken down even one Geodude, you don't get the achievement. Ooh, Starly! Ooh, I got gotcha. you. Ooh, I'm gonna get you. Ooh, I'm gonna get you good. Here we go. Yeah. Ba boom. Taking down, son. Daughter. Come on, Starly, don't run. Ah, Starly. Starly! I also watched I also watched five movies on my flight to San Diego. That's the only time that I watch movies, I swear. I watch all the movies whenever I'm on a plane. I always tell myself, I'm like, oh, I'm gonna get on the plane, I'm gonna work. I'm gonna get things done. Get things done while I'm on the plane. And then you know what happens? I never get things done and I watch five movies. Best movie I watched on the plane was Pig with Nicolas Cage. I was not expecting that movie to make me feel the things it did. But it did. Doggone good movie. Doggone good movie. Ten out of ten would recommend. And if you're telling yourself, if you're like, I don't know. Nicholas Cage isn't really my cup of tea. You're wrong. It's a fantastic Nick Cage movie. I also gotta be real and say that I don't really understand the Nick Cage hate. I think the worst Nick Cage movie is probably Ghost Rider. And it is indeed a bad movie. But it's not the worst. I've certainly seen worse movies. Ooh, Wicker Man was pretty bad too, though. Although Wicker Man wasn't really that bad, it was just so wild. A wild journey from beginning to end. I think people just see his crazier roles and assume he's a bad actor. Yeah, that's the, that's the part I never understood. Just because he's crazy, does that mean that he's a bad actor? I actually would... I think it probably would... Probably be more difficult to act crazy. He just does a lot of movies, that's for sure. He's also broke, dude. That's, that's my favorite fun fact every time they tell me that on, like, Watch Mojo or something. They're like, Nicolas Cage is very poor and bought an island. I love him in Mandy. That movie was bonkers, but he was fantastic. His energy worked. Well, Pig, his energy worked. Pig was his calmer energy, his, like, uh, family man energy, his matchstick men energy, which those are two of my favorite movies of all time. OAT. Magic Man in particular is like my number one movie of all time. His iteration of Left Behind was pretty rough though. Yeah. Yeah, that almost felt like he lost a bet. <laughs> That's about how I feel about that one. Felt like he wasn't even happy with his with his role there. I think the whole cast and crew lost a bet, for real. Well, such a weird series, such a weird interpretation, such a weird demonstration, changes, everything, everything about that is just strange. Have I still not beaten 15, Starly? Uno. Moss, baby! 
All we gotta do is find one more. One remains. You should have left that paycheck behind. <laughs> yes. Let's see. I was into it as a young end, but it hit right around the time as Passion of the Christ, and that was a time of my life. Yeah, that was another one. There are, like, moments of Passion of the Christ that I definitely, like, you know, they make you feel things. They make your little, your little like, pre-exvangelical side, like, oh, I love this. This is so, I, I love the, the feels. This is how he really felt. But then, um, oh, thank you, both of all. Solid! Solid. All I got to do is take down one more Starly, yeah. One more Starly, and I've got a perfect Starly run. All I need is for it not to run away. Then I can evolve both those bad boys and be done. Ah! Ah! <laughs> Why? Why would you do this to me? I just need one more, Starly! Why? Why do you treat me this way? No! No! You keep on taking down Geodudes, then. All I needed. All I needed. Video games are too violent. Let's watch Passion of the Christ instead, right? Yeah, I wish, uh, whenever I wrote that one for Rethink Church, I really, I wanted that, I wanted that blog to do better, and it did not. I was bummed. All of those, all those articles, I really try hard to write clickbait article titles. Because that's how you make it. That's how you make it on the internet. All right, are they seriously not going to? Yeah, I know you see me, okay? Whatever. <gasps> Get away from me, Geodude! Get away from me, Geodude! All I want to do is take down this Starly, dude. Please don't run away. Lord, have mercy. Yes! Yes! We're done! Please don't die from falling damage, you silly billy. Just get out of here. Just get the heck out of Dodge and evolve these Starlies and call it a Pokedex entry. Kapam! 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 Come on. All right. Let's evolve these bad boys. Evolve for me, thank you. The evolution song in this game goes hard. Way more than it needed to. Way more than it had to, but it did anyway. It chose to. You got it. I mean, listen to those drums, dude. Solid. If we don't call our discipleship path Mon Wesley's path to spiritual evolution, I'm quitting. Oh, no. You might have to quit. <laughs> oh, I hate that for you. All right, cool. Yay, we have a perfect. I would care to report my findings. Look at all those Mons. Made two grand. Good money. Good money. Respectable money. I have made some new observations. Thank you. Yeah! Perfect research. I wonder how far I got in Geodudes. Definitely defeated enough of them. Got to catch a lot of heavies. Catch in general. See them use rollout. Defeat with water type. Defeat with grass type. Leap out of ore deposits. Wow. And then evolve three of them. That's a lot of requirements. Holy moly. Quitting like all those people are moving back, moving to Canada back in 2016, right? I'm return to the village. One of those real, real empty arguments there. Empty threat. 
You know, you know what I just saw that I forgot about until just right now? I didn't remember this thing existed. Do you guys remember this thing? I forgot that, that it was, was a thing. thing. <laughs> I, bet I bet you guys, you guys did remember it. it. Is that the volume or the echo? Volume? Did you, did you miss, miss it? it? <laughs> I, forgot I forgot that it existed. it existed. Now I know. Now I remember. I also fixed it with tape, as you guys can tell. Masking tape, of course. Masking tape. The weird redheaded stepchild of the tape family. But the one I kind of prefer, if I'm being totally honest. I really like masking tape. I'm a big fan. Big fan of masking tape. Let's go see if the fields are ready. Jebediah. Have you plowed the fields? Are the fields ready, Jedediah? Look pretty ready to me. Yes. Let us find what we shall find. You got some stuff for me? Yes. Berries. Lots and lots of berries. Lapa berries, orange berries. That's all the berries you gave me, huh? Not super cool. It was not really enough berries. Not really enough berries, to be quite quite honest. If we can be totally honest with ourselves, we can say that that was not enough berries. Not near enough Bill haters. That's what I say. All right. I do. I would like my Pokemons back. I guess I won't trade them out yet, though. Because I need four pastures full or whatever. That's so many pastures, dude. That's so many Pokemons. Who shall we complete next? What shall we complete next? We have a lot of options. No, I didn't mean to favor that. That's kind of the problem. Like I said, there's just so many options. As we're wrapping up hour two, how are you feeling so far about the new schedule? I dig it. I dig it. We'll see. We'll see how I continue to dig it, but I really am enjoying that I have so much more time to do things. Like I feel like I can get so much more done, even if I do have the paralysis. Still feels much more doable, you know? Well, there we go. 17 hours into the game. Now we know how much time I've spent. God, it feels like so much more. I saw somebody, <laughs> somebody had spent like 25 hours and hadn't even beat the first boss yet. Because there's just so much to do. Where's an outbreak? Of Stunky. I don't really want a Stunky. No, I don't really care for Stunky. I want a distortion. What's up, Weesh? Definitely appreciate you up to do more tasks or longer form things for sure. For sure. Which we actually could do a top 10. I meant to do that at the beginning of stream. but I'm kind of into this now. I'm so invested. I need more shinies. We should cut a shiny while you were gone, too. I could always complete Shinx next. Even though I already got a shiny Shinx. Let's see. I have to catch 25. Defeat 10 with ground-type moves. Quick attack 25 times. Bite 25 times. Oh my goodness. I have different forms. I'll definitely achieve that. And I have to evolve three. Oh my goodness. That's a lot of requirements. That's so many requirements for something I already have a shiny of, dude. Really a lot of lot of requirements. But I mean, queer, look, look at, I caught 73 Bweasel. 73 Bweasel is so many Bweasel, dude. That's insane, man. I'm pitching Mon Wesley's uh, Path to Spiritual Evolution as the name of our discipleship pathway. Meeting with resistance, <laughs> to say the least. To say the least. Uh, Drifloon would be pretty cool. Shiny to catch. Or we could just shiny hunt. We could always just shiny hunt, because I wouldn't I wouldn't mind a shiny Starly. Um But if we're gonna do true blue shiny hunting, I probably need to turn on the settings. So you can manually save or you can auto save. 
I'm not gonna spam. I'm not gonna save spam. It's gonna be fine. Um, but apparently there's HUD controls in this, by the way, with motion sensitivity. But I haven't turned it on yet. We'll figure it out. I really want to listen for the shiny sound. You hereby support Mon Wesley going forward. Oh no! Bleach is on your side. If Bleach is on your side, who can be against you? So moved. <laughs> Y'all are hilarious, dude. I could always try to catch a worm pole. No shinies! Ooh, a mine junior. Don't mind that one, but um, okay. We just we just frozen, huh? We just frozen, frozen, huh? We just we just frozen, frozen, huh? Where'd he go? Don't even see him. We just frozen. What's going on, Bleach? What did you bring back with you? We haven't done that a single time. Oh, there he was. I see him now. Let's go catch the boy. This is my new trick. I run up to him and I hit him with this thing. Then I catch him. It's been working pretty well. We'll see. Time will tell. He's pretty rare. Yeah. I kind of figured. Oh, yikes. We passed the two hour mark. Oh no! Oh, now he's gone, gone. Long after he's gone, gone, gone. Still no shinies. We passed the two hour mark. Yeah, we have. We're going way past the two hour mark, baby! Kiss that two hour mark goodbye, yo! There's Rapidash again. I don't want a thing to do with you, Rapidash. You KO'd me. Call Spectrum. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, hopefully that never happens again. Got a bad feeling. Got a bad feeling it certainly could. Hey, Phil, look at Phil. <gasps> an Alpha Shinx. Do I have an Alpha Shinx yet? I don't think I do. I'm all sorts of... Uh-oh. He saw me. All sorts of down. Do I have an Alpha Shinx? I feel like I don't. They need a way to tell you what Shinx you're, you have and don't have. Is that what it is? I killed the last one? I wonder if I did an Agile, if that would be weak enough. Or I just do a Rock Smash. Let's try it. I didn't kill it. I did not kill it. I did not kill her. I did not. Oh, hi, Mark. Oh, wow, wowzers. You can't get much closer than that. Don't stare at me. I hate when they stare at me, dude. All right. Okay. All right. Let's see. Do we need a great ball or will a regular ball be enough? Let's just, why not? We got the great balls to use them. No, please. I want my alpha and my omega. No! With my great ball? He's enraged! Not enraged! Use my great ball in everything, dude. Try again. Apparently. Apparently. Apparently, the great ball is not effective. Apparently. All right, we'll try uh, putting it to sleep. Apparently, I've never been on television before. Have I shown you guys how moves work in this game yet? Oh, give me a break. Well, see if I can sustain. 
hit. Nope. So much for that. I'll show you guys after this. For sure. Why is the Shink so hard to catch, dude? We shall try. We shall try again. There's also definitely a way to choose who you attack, and I don't know what it is. And I don't have the time to care. Thank you! Sweet goodness! The Shinx did not want to be caught. Not one bit. Alright, you're you're really not who I want to fight, so I'm just gonna I'm just gonna heavy you out of the way. I'll show you guys how move works because it's super cool. I love the move mechanic in this game. It's the way every Pokemon game ever should be. Hang on, I gotta go back to camp. I'm gonna go back to camp. What was that sound? Was that the shiny sound? Was that the shiny sound? I don't know what the shiny sound sounds like. But I, I know there is a sound, and I want to learn what it sounds like. Apparently, apparently, <laughs> that one was an accident. Apparently, there is a, like, little shiny uh, sparkle that appears underneath their feet. Ah. I just don't know enough, dude. I have to learn. I have to learn the ways of the shiny hunter. All right, whatever. I needed to heal anyway. Okay. I'll show you guys how moves work. Because it's pretty rad. First, I'll collect this lost and found thing. That's another thing we can do that's very fun, is look for satchels. Um, so, this is the way that moves work. You go to the character. You go to change moves. And then all of their moves are here, and you just customize the four build. You don't have to go to a, to a move tutor. You don't have to collect uh, star pieces. None of that. You, or hard scales, not star pieces. You don't have to do any of that. You just go. All the moves that they've learned are going to be on the left. You can also add moves at, like, the move tutor. Uh, and that's just how you do it. And that's all there is. So if I want rock slide, I can have rock slide. If I want tackle back, I can have tackle back. So smart. Why did it take so long? Such a great, great mechanic. Such a great mechanic. When Dr. Martin Poker King comes along, then we will know the truth. So good, dude. I don't know about all that, but so good. All right, what do I want to do now? Make it daytime, keep, keep shiny hunting. Or do we want to go for another another deck? It's all fun. See? Raining. Again. What did I tell you guys? Raining all the time. Raining all the time in this game. Alright, we're going to listen for stars now. Listen very hard. Could be doing a really nice exercise in quiet. Listening. Focusing. Really hear your breathing. Listen as the air enters in through your nose and out through the mouth. The next time that you breathe in, I want you to hold that and count. One, two, three. It's just like, <laughs> let me breathe. Just keep counting. People are going to faint. <laughs> 17, 18, 19. Just keep holding. <laughs> Listen to the... Listen to the blood starting to 
stop up your vessels. Experience a constriction. Feel your, tr your chest start to raise as your lungs fill and begin to contort. 27. 28. Where is the shiny? I want to hear the sound. I don't even care if I find it. I just want to hear the sound. Everyone in chat died. <laughs> Everyone's dead. <laughs> I think voice is, uh, that voice is more uncomfortable than the van voice. Van voice wasn't a voice. That was just my voice. Sing songy. I did know some people that did ASMR. But they didn't do the voice ASMR so much as the, like, um, food ASMR. They, like, mixed in... They mixed in the food with, uh... What's it called? We eat a bunch of food. I guess that already is ASMR in a way. But this was a quieter version. <gasps> That's a big old worm pull! That's an alpha worm pull right there! Ooh, yeah! I'm gonna need that to be my friend. Get out of here. I don't care about you. I care about your big friend here. Ah! That didn't work. Why did my ball not work on him? Why are these not working? Why is this not working? Sigma. <laughs> okay. Wormpole. Uh, can I just catch you? Do we have to really worry about this? Do we have to do the whole rigmarole, friend? Can I just catch you? Can we just not do the song and dance? Can you just be my friend? Hmm? There's a chance. Nope. Why was I canceled? Uh, well, let's go for a real agile tackle. A very agile tackle. Please? Okay, good. Woo. Woo. Let's go for another one. Namas. Double cancel for not knowing why you were first canceled. Oh, no! If I ask again, does that make me triple cancel for asking after not knowing after being canceled? a real shame, dude. Oh, I want to know. Hey! I got us some cane. I just want to hear the shiny sound. And we're back into shiny hunting mode. We are searching Shining Pokemon. Hoping, wishing, waiting. Bam. All right, what are we gonna do? Can use this. Keep on giving Rhyhorn little boosts here and there. So did these not work or something, or was that just because it was? Uh, yeah, just because it was that guy. Random, my water tastes so good. We, you have an obsession, my friend. We No, it's good. It's good. If Of all the things, of all the things to really enjoy, water is a good one. But I think you like water too much. I do know exactly the feeling that you're describing, but you talk about water very often. It's just a regular occurrence. I gotta figure out how to evolve Ros Roserade. You do, you talk about water quite regularly, which is fine, water's good. Water's very, very good.
Did I find more Hopa berries? I wonder where those are. I bet they're in the next area. Oh, I could totally do this one. Almost as I talk about being a good gamer. I am a good gamer. I wouldn't have to talk about it so much if you guys didn't doubt it so much. If you guys would just have faith in my gaming ability, I wouldn't have to say how often I am such a good gamer. If you really want to thank anybody. Wasn't making a value judgment. <laughs> Out loud, anyway, yeah. Solid. All right. Let's go collect the satchel. I'm getting bored of doing this. But I promised you guys I was not going to be showing you anything spoilery, so I'm not showing you anything spoilery. Except, of course, for our good friend. We are dear. And Basque Legion. I'm going to make some lunch. What you have for lunch today, please? Oh, you're lurking. When you get when you get back, let us know what's for lunch. I'm very curious. I had um, some uh, salsa chicken tacos made in the instant pot. I could also catch this Snorlax. I've still not caught this Alpha Snorlax. I feel like everybody else in the game already has. I'm like the one person that just decided not to. You sleepy. No, I don't want to. Whoa! Whoa! Whoa, Nelly! Whoa, Nelly! Okay, cool. Alright. We're just gonna get this backpack. Backpack, 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 backpack. I wish I could use Lurk IRL like when someone comes into my office, but I'm thinking of other things while looking right at them as they talk. <laughs> Would be pretty convenient, wouldn't it? Woo. I'm a jumping boy. There's the backpack. Nope, those are the pink ones again. Not helpful. All right, let's look for this other thing. Need that. I want another request, please. I would be quite interested in receiving a request. There you go. There she is. All right, what you got for me? What you need my help with? What? You got Pokemon with you? I do. What are the odds? Fate must have must have my back today, bringing you here. Look, I know we just met. <laughs> Call me, maybe. Hey, hey I just I met, met you. you. Would you do something for me? I'd love it if you could bring me that Pokemon. Uh, what's his name again? Uh, the one with a scythe on each arm. I would love to bring you a scyther. Is there a scyther somewhere near here? I'd be tickled. I'd be tickled pink to find a scyther. Would you mind telling me where a scyther is by any chance? Because if you would, that would that would just be a delight. I, I haven't been to the center of Lake Verity, have I? No, I haven't. Let's go to it. Let's find out what's there. I'd love to know. Man, I tell you, that fish really, really just hops. Nate's office neighbors love that. <laughs> I do wonder sometimes what they can hear. Wonder just how much they can hear. I hope it's not anything at all. I'm thinking about starting a personal stream. Magikarp and Gyarados, nice. Thinking about starting a personal stream sometime soon. Um, or, or like Mesprit? And, and all of them in this game. <gasps> Unknown! Hello there, friend. Getting a Pokeball in. All good for the lurk, my friend. Thank you for the heads up. Anyway, I'm thinking about starting a personal music stream. And, uh, just because I miss playing music. And, uh... I'm so worried that they would, I don't know, be real upset if I'm just, like, playing music for an hour and a half. I feel like that's probably not the coolest 
thing to do as a neighbor. Yeah, boy! Although I do scream and laugh and yell pretty much 24-7 while I'm streaming. Ooh, that's an alpha Gyarados too, yo. That thing looks grumpy. I don't need it. I don't need it. I definitely don't need it. I need it. But yeah, there's a part of me that I've just been enjoying watching um, music streamers on Twitch. That's like who that now I've gotten into Twitch. Like I never watch Twitch. I never have watched Twitch. I've never been into it really at all. But just as of uh, recently, I've started to get into music streamers. I feel like I'd like to do it myself. Time will see. Time will see. That's definitely the phrase. It's definitely not time will tell. It's time will see. I wish I could even describe how much I love Weird Ear. Which music stream has grabbed your attention the most? Uh, hmm. Now that's a good question. I don't actually know their names. I just kind of click on whoever is shows up in my recommended. I look at recommended. I look for how many people they have listening, and I go for like the two hundred to three hundreds. Any more than that, and it's like too crazy. Any less than that, and they typically are still like figuring out how to use their music equipment, which I would be there. So I should probably support them better. But 200 to 300 is like a really solid, always going to be a really solid show that I can feel like I can like learn from. But I wish I had their names. I really don't. I don't know if you can check the followed in Checkpoint Church, but odds are if I follow them. All right. All these are crimson, 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 cobalt, 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 cobalt. Nobody's picked up mine yet. If anybody wants to go and find my, my items, it'd be real nice. Let's see. Am I a four star yet? Where am I at? I did catch another unknown. I caught an alpha worm pole. I've done a lot of things. I've done many, many things. So I need to know. Tell me, baby girl, because I need to know. Hey, we completed Shinx. That's fun. Oh no, it's been it's been complete. Uh huh. Oh, 140. Let's go back to the village. Maybe we'll go to the Crimson Mirelands just for a little bit. That's still not really spoilery. Or we could evolve my Kadabra. That'd be kind of fun. What's up? Who is this? Who are you? New request. What's that Pokemon up there? What's his name? What'd it do? Found one the other day that was really good. Sarah Capona is a piano player from France. She does a lot of free flow playing. Listened for an hour and could have listened all day. Honestly, that may have been because I, uh, I definitely have been listening to some, some French people. Cool Pokemon. Is it strong? Can it fly? It's pretty cool. <laughs> it's a pretty cool Pokemon. Thank you. It's cool. Why is it cool? Which part is cool? Tell me, tell me. All of it. It's all of it's cool. Okay, so you want me to complete the cool. Sure. I can complete the magic arp. I would love to have an Alakazam. I want to get items. So this is where whenever you complete stuff online, you can buy these. So I'm going to buy one. I'm going to buy a linking cord. They're very expensive. But I really want... I really want Alakazam. Do it! Oh, yes. I've been wanting Alakazam for a while! One of my favorite Pokemans. Yes, sir! Oh, he's so cool. Love him. Let's take a good look. 
Let's take a good look at, at our new at our new boy here. Whoa! What's up, dude? <laughs> what's up, man? You want to talk to Dartrix? What you want to do? You want to talk to Dartrix? There, there he is. You talk to him? You got friends? You got to talk to Rhyhorn. I get it. I get it. You want to talk to Rhyhorn? Here you go. You guys want to talk? You guys want to chat? That's cool. You want to talk to Monferno? Go ahead. You want to talk to Monferno? There he is. There you go. There's your buddy. Oh, yeah. You guys are friends, huh? You guys are good friends, huh? You guys want a bird? Here's a bird. Oh, what's that? You want me to choke? Here you go. Here's my choke. Everybody's hanging out. Oh, look at them. They're all friends. Oh, they're all friends. I'm serious. That is my favorite feature of this game. I love a lot of things about this game. That is number one. The fact that I can just let my Pokemon out whenever I want to. They can just chill and hang out. Have a good time. 10 out of 10. You guys ready for more? 10 out of 10 game. I cannot imagine anything better. Oh, no, wait, I should have kept those. All right. Oh, it's a Starly one this time. Ooh, well, that would mean I'd be, I'd be triply likely to get a Shiny. Pretty likely to get a Shiny this time. Get after it. How long does it last? I don't want to miss it. I don't want to miss it. Look at all these styly. There's a lot of styly. Are they going to run away? Surprise, it was just one, dude. Whatever they gotta do. I am definitely surprised it's just one. No shinies yet. Do I have an alpha starly? I don't remember. I do not remember. I wonder if any of them will run away in an outbreak. I wonder if that's like one of the things about an outbreak is that they won't run away. They definitely start by running away. There it goes. Yeah, so that's still a thing. This doesn't feel like much of an outbreak. Doesn't feel like much of an outbreak. So far. Not very outbreak-like yet. If I could be so bold. If I could be so bold as to say, not much of an outbreak. It still says it's happening. Gotta be honest with you. A little disappointing of an outbreak. I also haven't seen a single shiny yet. My second outbreak without a shiny. It does feel a little fake newsian. Come on, outbreak. Resident Evil Outbreak. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, we know. You run away. You run away. You could turn and stay. But you run away from me. Some bare naked ladies, approximately. 2009, maybe? I want to say 2009. Their very first album. That was Stephen Page. That was the single track, You Run Away. 
very first song released by the band with Ed Robertson as the solo frontman. Oh, hello. Thank you for reminding me about that computer. I will have to hop off just a minute early. I, I feel like I was promised an outbreak. Uh, promised an outbreak of sorts. Just not quite sure this is what I bargained. Definitely nothing like the Paris one, huh? Were you a part of the outbreak? No, I did not. I did not want that. I did not want to mess with Krikatot. In fact, I had no interest. I had literally no interest in in targeting Krikatot. All that I care about is these Dagnab Starlies. I did not. Hi, Krikatot. Go ahead and take it down. And then can we please get some outbreak stuff happening over here? Could we make this outbreak look a little look a little bit more like an outbreak, please? Could I have an outbreak? I mean, this is the saddest outbreak I've ever seen. Is it because they all ran away? Are they all spawned in different areas? Could that possibly be what it is? They all just spawned somewhere else? Or they don't despawn when they run away and so they're just they're just elsewhere? Like is it these guys? Are you a part of the Starly Outbreak? Are you a part of the Starly Outbreak? How am I supposed to know? How am I supposed to know who's a part of the Starly Outbreak? Ah, I don't know. I don't know how I'm supposed to know. I'm freaking out. I just want, I just want, a, I just want a shiny Starly. All I want is a shiny Starly from the outbreak. Just want to know what's the point of the outbreak. I just want to understand. I'm slouching as I'm talking. I'm 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 proceeding to get more slouchy the angrier I get at this disappointing outbreak. Is it you? Are you the culprit? Are you going to auto-spawn a bunch of them once I take you down? We'll find out. I've taken down every last Starly. Not just the men, but the women and the children. All of them. What is happening? Oh, ha. Ah. Another one. Oh wow, I thought it was gonna run away. I really thought it was gonna run away. I was not expecting it to stick around. Stick around, stick around, I stick around. It stuck around. That's it. That's all I got to do. <laughs> Great mechanic. I think it's fair to say that I'm not a fan of the outbreak mechanic so far. I wish that I could show you guys a space-time distortion. That's what I'd really like to show you. But for some reason, they're just refusing to show me one of those. Even with hours of gameplay. They are, like, not interested. 
I wonder why. I wonder why they are refusing. Okay. Let's go to Crimson Mire. Ooh, or we're so close to a four star. Hmm. Hmm. Only 40 points away. That's really close. All right, right back out. Would like to go to the Crimson Mire, please. Thank you. I don't know what I want to do here yet, but I'm here. First thing I do is probably collect a bunch of satchels. That's quickly become my favorite thing to do in this game. Oh, and I can make it over there now, too. You get some good swag. You get some good stuff from collecting those satchels. Ooh, nice. Some stardust. So if you see one of these rocks and they're shining, that means there's stardust in there. So if you like stardust... If you would describe yourself as a fan of Stardust. Ziggy or not. I gotta find the thing. Oh, there it is. The grass. Nice. Go for this one next. We'll say I'm not sure what the privacy settings on this game are, but I've noticed a lot of people in this game are named Richie. And I just think the odds... Odds are weird. Like, how many people would be named Richie? Do you know any Richies? Does anybody out there know a Richie? Because I don't think I know a Richie. And there have been a lot of Richies. And I feel like with that many Richies, I think there are, there, that's a privacy setting. I think when you get to, get to a certain amount of Richies, you have to know this can't just be chance anymore. I've definitely seen some that are real names. So maybe those are people that don't have a privacy setting turned on. But maybe it auto pulls from random Pokemon games. When it needs to. Pokemans. Oh, look, some Stardust. No! Not good. Get me out of here. I didn't know I could throw Pokemon at that. Well, that's news to me. This entire time, I did not know that was a thing I could do. That's super nice to know. Let me out of here! I just walked on water. I just walked on water. Ooh, a Pachirisu? Alpha Pachirisu! Don't mind if I patchery do. <laughs> no. All right. Oh, that's a level 40. Laugh at the set. Is that the fun? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> You gotta love a good moment, huh? Uh, can I catch this thing? I don't actually know if I can. I'm gonna guess... I'm gonna guess that I can. I really hope that I can. Ho! <laughs> I'm excited to see that clip now. Just instantly returning to RBF. He certainly played rough. That was definitely a played rough situation. <laughs> I'm still tickled. I'm tickled. I can't wait to see that clip. All right. Uh, let's go for a great ball. That worked so well before. Ah! I don't mind that at all, actually.
What is that? More likely to get drowsy or something? I don't know what that means, but I'm gonna try it. What does a strong hypnosis do? Got no clue what that means. Oh. Oh. I like that a lot. Let's try it again. Hey yo! Hey yo! Oh man, he's in rage now. Not crunch. That's gonna be one hit. Yeah. Yep. yep. Just keep going. I got plenty of great balls. Although for real talk, I'm beginning to wonder if great balls aren't like stacked in the deck. Ah. By the way, you can turn off. The feature, yeah, we got him. Ladies and gentlemen, we got him. Oh, there it is. Ladies and gentlemen, 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 gentl
while every gift with which I partake a sliver of my heart. Gorgeous. You didn't know you was getting poetry in your pokemans, did you? Bet you didn't even know you were getting poetry in your pokemans. But you are. From Arceus's live journal. <laughs> Love it. Yep. I can't wait for the sequel when they release his MySpace. <laughs> oh man, that's good. I haven't seen Petalil as the thing. Ooh. Get out on. Thank you, but no thank you. I don't want to talk to you. So close. Found it. Another old verse. What was it? What was it? Oh, was it all those stocks? Oh, is that a Shellers? No, that's a Krogon. Thought it might be a Shellers. Oh wait, that's blue! That's blue! <gasps> that's very good, that's blue! Is it heading that way, do you think? Gotta be, right? Is it you? Are you the person I'm looking for? Wanda! A person! Yes, you're welcome. I found you. I found you. He's so concerned. Oh, I see. They're being cute. They're being cute. Nice. And another one gone, and another one gone, another one by the dust. Oh, I couldn't tell what that was. What a weird looking thing that just was, huh? Enough, Ghastly. I'm not messing with you right now. I'm not playing games with you right now, Ghastly. Ghastly, I'm not playing games right now. Ghastly, I'm trying to. I'm trying to figure out. Ghastly, I'm trying to figure. I'm trying to figure out where the thing is. I'm not here to play games with you, Ghastly. Allow me to glitch myself up this mountain. Hang on. Get back to you. Now. Please send me where I need to go. No. Yeah. I wasn't expecting this to become a, tw a treasure stream out of nowhere. It's an old verse. Old verse number one. Mm -hmm. okay. Okay, 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 okay. I would like I to read it now, yes. Once, 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 once there were two. And one, and one looked, looked upon, upon time's time. steady, steady pace. pace. And, and one, one looked, looked upon, upon the expanse, expanse of space. And the two, and the two set, out. set out. The fullness of future did, did they see. see. The world's far end, end would they greet. Two, two different, different paths, paths, each walking, walking alone, alone a path their own, thought, thought they walk with, with mighty sin. Wow. Wow. Big moves. You love to see it. All right. Let's see. There's a combi, but I'm not on Apom Hill or whatever, right? Yeah. Ooh, what's that? Oh yeah, the person I returned to. Let us return. Then I probably gotta hop off soon, folks. Three hour stream, yo! We gotta figure out what in the world we're doing tomorrow because we're not playing Inscription. Oh, not you. I had a ton of fun. I enjoyed my stay as always. All right, where's that person? Where's Wanda? I returned Wanda. 
I returned Wanda, and I deserve a reward. Thank you. Oh, Galaxy Hall. Okay. No more inscription. I can't believe we're done. I can't believe we're done with that game. Time for Dark Souls again. Oh, huh. Bleh. No, we actually have a bunch of games coming out very soon. We have so many games coming out on the horizon. Yeah! Yeah! Oh. On the horizon! <laughs> I did mean Elden Ring, but also Horizon. I've never played the OG Horizon. But I feel like I don't have time for that right now. Especially not while I'm so into this game. You know. You know what I'm saying. Picking up what I'm putting down. Hey friend, do you have anything for sale? You don't. Yep, yep. Hey, your friend made it back. I did a thing. Wanda's back. She's calling him Zeke? Yay! I got some stardust. If only I had a time distortion so that I could get some plates. And because I want to show you guys what a distortion looks like. They're super cool. Did it, did it seriously wait for me to get a Pachirisu before it offered that up? For realsies? That's pretty wild. Gotta catch them all. Catch them, catch them, gotta catch them all. Gotta catch them all! Pokemon! How many merit points do I have? Oh, no, I didn't want to do that. Not enough. Not enough for my champ. Nope, still not done. Interesting. So the farm the farm takes a while. It's very difficult to figure out how long everything takes. But I'm super excited to progress the story somewhere. But this was fun. This is a good time. This is probably what we'll be doing for the next couple Mondays. Um, we'll just kind of see as I, as I continue to progress through the story. I don't know if I want to start a whole new campaign on this game because... I don't know if I want to do that. <laughs> that's just, that's the end of it, is I just don't know if I want to do that. So we'll see. We'll see what we end up doing with this game. How it ends up working and all that good stuff. Yeah. But this has been a ton of fun. Three hour streams. We'll figure out what to play tomorrow. If you guys have any recommendations, as always, drop them over in the Discord, exclamation point Discord in the chat to join our excellent, awesome, all time, super cool, fun times over on the Discord. Yeah, there it is. We'd love to have you over there. We have a lot of fun. We've had a lot of people join this weekend. It's been a big weekend for the Discord. Come join us and vote for Dark Souls. Don't do that. Do anything but that thing. Do join the Discord, but don't do that thing. Don't do the thing that we said. We don't, we don't, we don't stand that. Play Coffee Talk, by the way. Play Coffee Talk, people. But yeah, this has been a super fun time. Thanks so much for hanging out on the stream today, folks. Really do appreciate it. Appreciate your time. Appreciate you being here. Appreciate you hanging around on the Discord. We have a ton of fun, fun. here at Checkpoint Church. Church. Thanks for watching our Amusha Kotensei, however you pronounce it, video um, over on our YouTube channel. channel. If you don't know what I'm talking about, about then you, you, should should watch, you should watch it. Watch it. You should, you should watch, watch the Mushiko Tensei video, video that we posted on our YouTube, YouTube channel. channel. Uh, I did a little sermon on that one, and it's popping off. It's popping off. Uh, my aversion to Dark Souls is that I am very bad at it. It's very difficult. It's really challenging. It's a very challenging game. I really was, I mean, I was bad at it, but I don't think I was like the worst ever. Like, I think it's just a hard game. It's not a game that I got, I only got frustrated like seven times. <laughs> that was it. <laughs> only only like, like seven, seven. max. At best. Yeah, we're up to 287 views on that video. That's, that's pretty that's big. big. We had our uh, Spider-Man video last week that only did 50. So uh, for some reason, Mushiko Tensei, people are really liking. They're really digging. So check it out. Give us some support there. Maybe drop a like to balance, balance out, out all, all the dislikes. Because I also tweeted out that with great, with great views, 
Hang on, I'll say this in my best epic voice. With great views comes greater dislikes. That was my tweet of the day today. Very true. So, but yeah, this has been a ton of fun. Love the longer stream as well. So yeah, I have no real problem with Dark Souls. From what I've heard, I um my my chat may have strolled, uh, uh, trolled me, not strolled me, may have trolled me a little bit by giving me Demon Souls to be my first Dark Souls. Everybody says I should have started with something else, anything else really. Um, though I have no idea. But Bloodborne is that the one that you're supposed to start with? I don't know. I I don't know. Did you not? Wait, I don't even know who to trust you. <laughs> well, it was also it had just popped out for the for the PS5, and so it was like a big deal. Bloodborne first, then any Souls game. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see what happens. There are a lot of games coming out. There's a lot of exciting stuff going on, and I got I got a Steam backlog. Log that you to believe. So we're gonna play Frog Fractions again tomorrow, and uh, and then we'll see where we go from that. Base take from Perspectus. Folks, I feel like I have a little bit of an echo. I don't know what's going on there, but I hope that you're well. I hope that you've had a great week. And I look forward to streaming again with you tomorrow. Back to our normal time tomorrow, 1 to 4. Uh, we're going to be streaming here on twitch.tv slash Checkpoint Church. We're always active over on our Discord. I know we just dropped that in the chat, but I'm just reminding you again. We're always active over there, always having a good time. Uh, and then Wednesday night from 7 to 10. And then a date to keep in the back of your mind. Next Wednesday, February 9th, um, I'm going to announce this later on, probably tomorrow, but next Wednesday is going to be something we're calling the State of the Reunion, and basically for the first little chunk of stream, I'm just going to be telling you guys what's ahead, what's in the future, what our level two members have kind of come together and talked about, and where we're going in the coming quarter. So look forward to that next February, uh, next February, <laughs> uh, next Wednesday. February 9th, uh, 7 o'clock during our usual stream time. And then we'll play games together right after it. But we're going to start out with that kind of a thing. So it should be fun. Folks, I hope that you know that we believe these three things to be true about every single one of you out there. Stay tuned for February 2023. We believe these three things to be true, whether it's in February 2022 or 2023 or beyond. We believe that, number one, God loves you, like really, really loves you. Number two, we love you. We want community with you. That's what we're doing here on Twitch, Discord, and YouTube. And number three, we believe that you, yes, you, matter you're a person of sacred worth the world is a better place why because you are in it folks until the next time that i get to see you have a wonderful rest of your day and until then bye bye